this is Allison Kira with Allison Kira Organizing. Today I wanted to tackle a subject matter that can get a little bit tricky for a lot of people because the same rules that you use for purging for everything else in your house don't always necessarily mesh up with books. So stay tuned for my three favorite tips on how to purge books successfully. Okay, tip number one, if you have a book and you've owned it for two years or more, but you haven't actually read it, there's a good guarantee that you're not actually interested in this book, and that's okay. So it's time to get rid of a book like this. Tip number two, if you have books that you've owned and read before, but you just haven't read them for two years, that's okay. The goal here is you want to keep books around you that you love, that inspire you, that when you or someone else is going through your list of books, they're the books that represent who you want you to think about yourself, but also how you want others to think about yourself. So maybe books that um, are inspirational to you or books that are um, helping you get to that next level in your career or books that just make you feel really good about yourself or bring back great memories. But that doesn't mean that they have to be all of them. Tip three. Okay, so my favorite thing about books is Unlike a lot of other household items, if you get rid of them, there's almost no fear of not being able to get an exact replica because you can buy that exact same book in a store or you can go to the library and check that same book out for free. So really, you don't have to have that same level of like fear, guilt, and shame when going through your books because they are replaceable. And if there is a book that isn't, then don't let that one go. But most books are replaceable, so you don't have to hold so tight onto them. Because again, there are libraries and stores that sell the exact same copies. So this is Allison Kira. Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for my next one because I help you keep clutter out of your home and out of your head.